Hello and welcome to another VRTK tutorial video. In this video, we're going to show how we can set up a vignette. So when we're using our smooth locomotion, it sets up a comfort tunnel for us to prevent motion sickness. Please consider becoming a VRTK patron. There are plenty of membership levels to sign up at and it really helps to fund these videos. We're back in the same scene that we set up our axis move locomotion. And what we're going to look at now is how we can prevent motion sickness when we're moving around with that smooth motion by using a screen vignette. So to do that, we're going to bring in the vignette package from the Tilia package manager. If I just go into window, down to Tilia, then to the package importer, and then find visuals vignette and click add to add that to our project. And once that's been added to our project, we can close the package importer window down. And now what we need to do is bring in that vignette prefab. But what we want to do is attach it to our headset so it's always following our headset around and the easiest way to do that is to go to our tracked alias and then into headset alias and within headset alias this is where we're going to add our vignette so if we right click on the headset alias game object and then go down to tilia and then prefabs and then visuals and then vignette we can then add the visuals vignette prefab and we can see that's been added here the only thing we need to do is set up the velocity source of what this needs to track the faster the velocity that the source is moving, the more the vignette will come in and the slower the velocity, the wider the vignette will be. So all we want to do is track how fast our play area alias is moving. So when we're moving that play area alias artificially, we want to fade that screen. We're just going to use play area alias as our velocity source. We can then decide when we want this velocity to apply. Do we want it to apply on everything or just on the velocity of when we're moving forward or backwards? Do we want it on angular velocity if we're smooth rotating left and right or any combination of the two? We can change the color of our vignette. We can change the size of our vignette, how much of the screen it takes up when it's at maximum velocity, the feather amount of the feather around the edge of the vignette and the duration, how quickly that vignette closes in and expands. But for now, we'll leave all those as they are. And that's it. We've set up our vignette. So let's jump into the scene and see that working. So now we're in the scene, we can see if I press forward on my thumbstick, we get the screen fade effect, this vignette come in around the edge of our screen, and it provides a nice comfort tunnel for when we're moving forward and backwards, and hopefully that should reduce any motion sickness players get from using free locomotion. I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, leave any likes, dislikes, comments down below. Please consider becoming a VRTK patron, and I'll see you for the next video. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.